Learning English can be confusing with so many words that look and sound the same. A malapropism is the mistaken use of a word in place of a similar sounding one. Often the effect can be amusing, but it can also lead to misunderstandings if English isn't your native language. Here are some examples you may encounter. Can you be more Pacific? Pacific is the name of an ocean. Pacific can also be an adjective meaning peaceful. The word which should have been used in this sentence is specific. I wondered round the house. Wondered means to have thought or contemplated something. The word which should have been used is wandered. I dissembled the furniture. Dissemble means to conceal or disguise. The word which should have been used is disassembled. Let's proceed with the meeting. Proceed refers to something which comes before another thing. The word which should have been used is proceed. Vocabulary mistakes are common in English due to words or phrases being mispronounced or changed. Here are some common mistakes you may encounter. Irregardless is a mistake resulting from the words irrespective and regardless being combined. If you are trying to say in spite of something, use irrespective or regardless, but not both. In regards to is another common mistake. There is no need to pluralise the word regard by adding an S on the end. The phrase should be in regard to. Many British people say slippy instead of slippery. Slippy is such a common mistake that the word has now made its way into the dictionary, but slippery is the correct word. If you would like to find out more about what we do, visit us at www.accordbusinessenglish.com.